Hi, this is Nick, Nikki, and I'm back with um, some more letter requests. So, letter requests number 34, 170, and 77. So, 34 from book one is this. That everything you feel inside of you is true. Everything that you feel I'm going through is true. We feel each other like a mirror which is between our bodies sending the waves of emotion, fear and doubt that suddenly hit us as if from nowhere. And then the feeling of complete love, contentedness, inner peace and a warm feeling in our hearts that emanates out through every part of me and awakens our souls. Trust that we are doing this together. Please do not have any doubts. Please know that love is the way that we will succeed in our journey and will win the race. We have our future together, which is built on the strongest foundations of creation, being created together, finding each other again, and finding what true love and the power of love can do. So that's 34 from book one. 34 from book two is this. 34 from book two. I want you to remain in your heart. Focus on our love. Focus on keeping in line with your spirit, which is calmness, peace, serenity, the purest divine love and light. That is what you must do to help us back together. Imagine throwing a stone into a pond that is completely still and see the ripple effect it has throughout the pond all the way to the edge. Every part of the water is affected by the stone. Now imagine throwing a stone into a rocky and stormy and wavy sea. The impact of the stone cannot be seen, nor felt by the water. Our energy is the water. Keep us calm and I can feel you. Every bit of you. Mm, that's gorgeous. I think I, I know whose that letter is. Okay, 34 uh, from book three is there's so much I want to say and so much I want to say sorry for sorry that I didn't realize all of this before realize what I was giving up on me it was what I was giving up on or running away from I realized that now but I just couldn't explain what was happening to me I didn't understand it and I certainly didn't know it was all about you all I did know it was very strange intense and overwhelming feeling when I was with you and I knew when I'd never that I'd never experienced it before or would ever again but it was all so new to me I guess I'd never let my feelings get the better of me before and now that's all I can seem to focus on my feelings for you okay and that was 34 from book three so now I'm going to read 100 number 170 from book three and it is my little beautiful ray of light oh how i adore you how i worship you like the sun how you bring the meaning back into my life for lifetimes and lifetimes we have been looking and now everything is coming together you must follow your light because where there is light that is where you will find me shining a torch onto your path our path home is etched into our hearts. We have love flowing through our veins. Our hearts pump fast for each other. Together we will create miracles. Our love will generate life. How exciting. <laughs> okay, so number 170 from book two is uh, this. And it is, I want you to know that you are here for a big purpose. We chose you very carefully and you are part of a rainbow group that are here to bring the rainbow technicolor of light to the planet. The way you do this is to shine bright like a star every day, to always love as if it's your last day on earth. Never be afraid to show or speak your love to people, even when they don't show it to you back. You are here to see through people's fears and to melt people's hearts, which you will do everywhere you go. Always remember to be true to you. 
follow your rainbow heart and let it shine 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 we love you now that i know is for somebody's son um here is a rainbow child uh so that is just gorgeous okay letter 170 from book one hello my love i want you to be with me i wish for us to be together with every part of me i reach out for you in my sleep when i wake up in the night having dreamt of you and of, of our life together i see your face when i close my eyes and i feel your skin touching against mine and when i lie in bed dreaming of our time together it's been so long and has felt like an ocean has been between us. An ocean of emotions have been built up inside me for such a long time. And it was you who brought them all up to the surface. And I didn't know how to handle them. I didn't know how to deal with how I was feeling. I'm sorry I didn't do a very good job of telling you. I will do. I promise that when I come back, it's going to be different. I'm going to be different. I love you. Oh. okay uh and it, i'm like i love you too okay letter number 77 it is letter number 77 from book uh one so my love my sweetest dear lady i've wanted to be able to tell you how much i have felt your love for such a long time but have never been at the mercy of myself to tell you I am my own worst enemy. I have let fear rule my life, always going for the safe option, not the option that really ignites my fire and challenges and awakens my soul. That is what you did for me. We do for each other. But the time is coming that I no longer can just play it safe. I don't want to live an unfulfilled life. I want to feel the challenge and the bliss of what true love feels like. I want to really feel desire and have someone, you, desire me. I want to experience true passion and the real meaning of heartfelt love. I don't want a mediocre life anymore. I want to really live. I love you and I'm going to come to you. Okay, no more mediocre life. I want true love. Okay, so 77 from book two. That my heart is yearning for us to come together again in a beautiful, passionate embrace. All of our bodies connecting from the touch of our foreheads together to the interlinking of our fingers in between each other and the feeling of our beating hearts in unison as we lie wrapped in each other. Oh, how I long for that. How I long for the days and nights where we share all our intimate moments our secrets, our passions, our lifelong dreams that we had when we were young that we can still do together. There is so much that we have to make up for. We will live in loving bliss together. <laughs> Makes your heart melt. I'm like, yeah, I want that, come on. Okay, 77 from book uh, three. No, yeah, from book three is uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being such a jerk and behaving like a complete idiot. I let myself get taken over by my fears and then I just panic and think I need to get away from this intense feeling that you stir up in me. I know it's not fair to take it out on you. It's just that I have no idea where it comes from. It just grips me. And then I have to go on my own and spend some time just trying to work out what the hell is going on with me. None of this should be taken out on you. I'm so sorry. It's like it's not me. I just want to be able to be me, to feel at peace with loving you. <laughs> so that's why, all of, you know, that's why I don't give in to the fears and the doubts because, you know, that's the whole point. That's the whole journey. So, letter 133. Hang on in there. Don't let me go and don't let us go. Even though you may think it may seem impossible, know that we can do this. You are pulling me through into the light. You have turned the light on in my soul. And now there is no turning back. There is only forward motion. We are on the love locomotion. 
and I can't wait to do the love locomotion with you. I want to feel our hips swaying together and our lips locking in each other. You are my heart, my soul. My very being is entwined within you. We are one. Together, we are love. <laughs> I mean, just, I mean, it's just surreal. There's so many of them and yet they're all just so different. I mean, it's just weird. Uh, right, so 133 from book two. Uh, I want you to follow the yellow brick road. Follow the signs that are coming to you. Where do you see me? I'm right here inside of you. The answer is within you, not on the outside. But if you follow the signs that come across your yellow brick path, you will know that they will all lead you back to me. I am your home. I am your golden path. I am your red shoes and slippers. That if you tap three times and ask for guidance, I will be there to guide you back to me. Know in your heart who I am and trust that your heart knows the truth. We are bound together for eternity. Oh, <laughs> 11, 11 on the clock, just as I said that. So, uh, 133, we are bound together for eternity. So this is from book one, 133. <gasps> oh my God, what a perfect one to end on because the first song I ever put out on this channel was Imagine by John Lennon. So listen to this. I often imagine a world where we can just be together where when we met, we were together from the very beginning without all this crazy toing and froing that we've been through. I'm sorry that I keep pulling away from you. It's just that I think I won't be able to cope if I get too close and then I lose you. It's a stupid reason I know and I keep trying to tell myself to trust. I know deep down that my fear is irrational, that I know I can trust you 100%. It's all in my head, but I'm totally working on me at the moment. I'm working on being in the right mindset to come back to you for good. <gasps> oh, that was quite emotional. <laughs> okay, especially because it references imagine, imagine taking me right back to the beginning because again, imagine is the first song I ever put out on this channel. So, Again, beautiful messages. Thank you so much. I've had more requests. So the next, the other letters that still need to come are letters number 53, 124, 46, and 73. So that's 53, 124, 46, and 73, which I will be doing next. All right. Thank you. Bye.